got it again, Maddie. Yeah. Sending us to have you this time. No, week. thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Glad to be here. Yeah. Ready to go. Okay, here with LaSalle. Yeah, um, yeah. I think the match was really a, just a battle back and forth. Um, I think last year being here for the first time in program history really prepared us for this moment. Um, I would like to say that you know overall I'm really proud of this group. I think they worked extremely hard to get here once again. Um, I think we've proven that we deserve to be here and belong here, which is great. Um, and then overall the gameplay, I think it was back and forth. It was kind of a battle of serve receive on our side. When we were in system, we were performing well. We were getting them out of system, performing you know, great offensively, um, but they applied a lot of service pressure, they applied a lot of offensive pressure, and I think that was the biggest difference in the match. Either of the student athletes, how would, you, how would you evaluate the beginning of the match? It was, it was back and forth all the way up to about 18-18, and then they kind of just stretched out there at the end, but it, as Coach said, it, it was back and forth. Um, I definitely think that we came here with a lot more energy. Um, like Coach said, we deserved to be here. We knew that we wanted to fight for it either way, leaving it out on the court. Um, we've grown so much from last year to this year too, so just competing for each other definitely, showing up to play. Yeah, I think we came out a lot of confidence this, this game. I think we knew what we were walking into and we kind of just brought that upon ourselves just to play with confidence and that's why we, we stayed with them neck and neck. They just brought on a lot of pressure onto us and that's, that was the difference at the end of the first set. Coach, you talked about being here last year and, and for either of the student athletes. How much does that uh, help you in the week leading up to now? From the time you know you're coming back here, there's a comfort level, you were here. How much did that help you? I know you're playing a good team, but yeah. at this point, it's, it's a lot about you. Yeah, oh, tremendously. Um, you know, I think last year, after winning the GNAC championship, coming here, playing a, you know, a powerhouse school like Johns Hopkins, um, you know, I think the nerves got to us a little bit. Um, this year, I think we knew what we were walking into, even though Ithaca is also a great program, great school. Um, you know, we watched film, we knew that we had what it takes to hang with them, um, and it was really just going to be a battle of that serve and serve receive and making sure that we can get them out of system. Um, and overall, I'm extremely proud of the seniors that kind of led our group throughout the last four years, um, and specifically the underclassmen I thought played really well today. I thought we had big time performances from one of our DS's, Anna Lee. I think she played tremendously in the back row, um, even as a freshman. And then Morgan Bogley going back to serve on game point, not just getting it in, but being aggressive with her topspin looked really good. Talk about the season and, and what it meant. Think about um, where the program has come last year. You're here for the first time, and now you came in, and, and there was definitely a different feeling with your team this year when you arrived and, and played through this match. Um, I definitely think that we came in with confidence, but um, just knowing that we still have to fight for it either way, um, just being confident with our play, but knowing that we have to fight for each other and depending on each other to get through the, the games. Yeah, and I think this just being, as juniors, this is our last year with the seniors that we've, we haven't had seniors at all since we've been a part of this program. So we've really like tried to rebuild, the, rebuild this program. And I think this was, as our last year we came in, we were like, this is all or nothing. Like we, we worked for the past three years trying to get to this point. Mm -hmm. And I think that really toned into our confidence and just our competitive fire because we've worked so hard for the past three years to get to where we are now. So. Back on the time you've been there, first year of the Now the standard is 30 wins and goes to the NCAA tournament. How, did, how did, like, talk about that and how it makes you feel and what it's taken to get here. Uh, yeah, it's taken a lot. Um, when we took over the program, uh, what was it, four years ago now, um, you know, it was an eight-win program, uh, consistently trying to fight just to make GNAC playoffs. Um, we had, I think, maybe seven girls on the roster when I took over. Um, we brought in girls from all over the country, very confident, motivated athletes, um, and that was the seniors' class. So. You know, props to them. They really helped us build this culture, build this really just powerhouse in the conference. Um, and what's great about that is there, you know, that trickle down effect of creating that culture, that work ethic, um, and then also the competitiveness. You know, we see it in our gym every day. Um, we like to think that, you know, our second string is just as strong as any other team in our conference. So it prepares us to compete at the highest level. Um, and then coming out here, we just want to, you know, keep going and keep rolling and make sure that everybody knows that we're here to stay. Um, and I think our underclassmen really proved that today. Uh, the juniors through freshmen, I thought they played tremendously, and I, you know, I would like to think that we'll be back here and hopefully uh, make another dent in the tournament next year.